going on guys? This is the Lone Armada and today I am back with another Pokemon Showdown gameplay and today I have a pretty good gameplay for you guys. I think this gameplay was fantastic. It's it's I, I think it's a really good gameplay. I'm going up against what I think is one of the worst kinds of trainers out there. And you're gonna see what I mean once I click this instant replay button. So of course I send out the hooligan and he sends out his thunderous. And he taunts me, but that's okay, I wasn't going to go for a Dragon Dance like I normally do. I go for a knockoff, knocking off his whatever he had. Leftovers? I don't know, I didn't see. Then he goes for a Thunder Wave, and I go for an Ice Punch, and I finish him off, and I'm Shed Skin, so that paralyzation goes away. Now he sends out Drift Blimp. Yep, he's using the Evasion. The Evasion. That is so annoying. He is one of these, kind of, these kinds of trainers. I'm going to keep going for that knockoff, and I miss, and he goes for a Substitute now after getting two Evasions off. And then, like, I, I hit it, I hit his substitutes with my knockoff, so his it's not working out so well. I'm finally starting to hit him. Now he goes for another minimize, and freezing his evasion, and I miss again. Now he goes for a substitute, and I'm not gonna hit that substitute. I'm just gonna keep missing. Hooligan's aim sucks. He needs glasses. He he can't see right. He just keeps missing. Now he knocks off my citrus berry, and he goes for a baton pass, passes the substitute and the evasion, goes to the ninjas. And we all know what the Ninjask is good for in these kind of teams. Sword dances and his speed boost. So he's getting them speed boost. He's getting those sword dances up. And now he's going to use the protect. And now I'm going for the dragon dance. Because I feel like I need to take out that sub if I do manage to hit it. And now he goes for another sword dance. Getting that attack boost. And he like this is pretty much what he's doing. He just keeps getting attack boost. Just keeps getting speed boost. And I just keep missing. You know, I think here I'm gonna use uh, no. All right, I use ice punch. I take out the sub. He gets another speed boost up, and now he sends out another substitute. And I yeah, here's where I use drain punch, thinking he was gonna switch to another Pokemon. I was thinking maybe he'd switch to Smurgle, and then I could just take the Smurgle out and one uh, drain punch. But that didn't work out so well. So now he's gonna get another speed boost up. He's gonna use that protect. He's already got his sub up. Now he's maxed out speed, maxed out attack. Not maxed out evasion, but close enough. It's it's helpful for him. Now he sends out the Scolipede, I miss my Ice Punch, and he goes for the Iron Defense. Now he plans on boosting his defense. Now he's going to go for another Iron Defense. Now he has three times Iron Defense. I keep missing my attacks. He goes for another Iron Defense. Now he's got maxed out defense. I miss another knockoff. He uses the Baton Pass over to the Machamp, where I finally hit my knockoff, and I take out the sub. Now he uses the Dynamic Punch and finishes the hooligan. I mean like times four attack, times four speed, of course he's gonna finish me off. I send out hugs thinking he's gonna do something about it. Nope, he's got a thunder punch. I send out zap, I got the prankster ability, so priority thunder wave, and I managed to paralyze him, which works out for Master Roshi here, so now I can use Psychic and take that guy out. He doesn't have any special defense boosts, and I got lucky hitting him. Now he sends out the ninjas, I take out that sub that he sends out. He got that speed boost there, now he's going to use Protect, I'm going to use Psychic, and he gets another speed boost off. So this is his strategy, he's going to keep using subs, he's going to keep using Protects, and that's all just to get his speed up. Right now, attack is not his priority, seeing how he can't really do anything about it, because I'm just going to take him out in one hit if he tries to use a Sword Dance. So he's going to keep boosting his speed, he's going to keep using those substitutes, he's going to keep using that protect, he's just going to keep boosting up that speed, and as you see there, he's got leftovers. It's a pretty good strategy on his part, but it's not going to work against the almighty Master Roshi. Master Roshi does not fall for this stuff. He, he, he doesn't need glasses, because his eyes are better than the normal person eye. So Master Roshi won't fall for all that ev ev evasion crap. Now he sends out Smeargle, not going to do anything, I'm going to take it out with one sidekick. Now, oh, by the way, about the Smeargle, I would have put Focus Ash on that Smeargle, but he didn't do that. I mean, I don't know, Smeargle's not really that tough of a Pokemon. I would have definitely put a Focus Ash on that. Anyway, so now we're just repeating the same pro uh, uh, process with the Ninjas. Just keeps going for Protects, keeps going for Substitutes. Now I switch over to the Shadow Ball because I'm running low on Psychics, and I want to save a Psychic for that poisonous bug he has in his team. Now he sends out the stupid Drip Flim. I got those Shadow Balls, he is out of here, and he just leaves. He just leaves. He doesn't want to deal with it, and he just leaves. Good. I don't like those kind of trainers. I don't like the kind of trainers that just stay there, baton pass, boost up your stats, until you have the ultimate beefy Pokemon. No. I don't like those kind of teams. I admit it can be fun at times, but it's not fun 
being the person that goes up, that randomly goes up against those kind of teams. Not not just randomly. It's it's no fun going up against those kind of teams at all. But good old Master Roji here saves the day and takes out those Pokemon. I don't have to deal with them all thanks to Master Roshi. Give Master Roshi a round of applause. I hope to see you guys in the next video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I did spit quite a bit in this video. I got lots of saliva in my mouth. I'm going to go now. Bye. Yeah.